Hi guys, I'm Mimi Hart and welcome back to my channel. And for those of you who may or may not know, I happen to love Vocaloid. I think it is a great form of art that well deserves its fan base that it's gotten over the past few years. But that being said, naturally there is going to be a few people that misunderstand Vocaloid. Yes, there is songs that are way overly cutesy, which I kind of love anyway, that's another list for another day. And there are songs that are absolutely gruesome and creepy and disturbing and weird. But it can also cover some real topics that would actually surprise people on the way it's presented. So today, I'm going to give you five Vocaloid songs that will change a person's mind about how they feel about Vocaloid and maybe even convert them to listening to more Vocaloid. And just so you all know, this list is in no particular order. I happen to love all of the songs on this list almost equally. So anyway, so without further ado, let's get started. Number five, Solitary Hide and Seek MV. The song tells a story from a little girl's perspective of a broken family. Her father doesn't have much to do with her and her mother has having an affair with some man. The girl starts hating herself more and more and more, thinking that everything is her fault. She eventually attempts to commit suicide, but fails, and awakens in the hospital with her family looking over her. And it leaves you in hopes that everything is going to be fine, that everything is going to be better. This is a very real topic that happens a lot in today's society. Families are more broken up now than what they used to be. And a lot of the times the children believe that it's their fault, that they're not doing something right. That it's their fault that their parents are fighting or just not communicating much anymore. And I do know that there is a good chance that someone watching this video right now is probably going through the same thing. There's a lot of children out in the world that feel the exact same way as the little girl in the song does. And this song portrays it perfectly. And I just wanted to say, if anyone watching this video is going through the same thing right now, just know that it's probably not your fault, and sometimes things just don't work out the way that they should. But always keep your hopes high and try to look forward as much as you can. I know that's a little bit cheesy and I'm really sorry to open up the video with this, but hey, it is what it is, so deal with it, okay? Number four, the story of evil. Okay, so this entry is a lot different than the ones I have next on this list. This is actually a series of songs and videos. And I will put the link in the description for the playlist down below. But this basically tells a tragic tale of two twins. One is born to be the next heir to the throne and becomes queen eventually. Her twin brother, on the other hand, is destined to be her servant. I'm not going to go into too many details because this is a really good story and I want you guys to see for yourselves but some crazy shit happens in these videos and in this or in these songs and some major tearjerkers so if you guys want to go check it out I'll put the links in of all of the songs in the description below so you can go check it out for yourselves. Number three, please don't have laid down your life. This one is an anti-war song and the tragic story of a woman who has lost her lover in, in that said war. Everyone is celebrating because the war has ended, but she is feeling nothing but sorrow as her loved one has passed away during that war. I'm sure this one really reaches out to a lot of people that have lost loved ones 
during battle, and it's good to listen to from time to time whenever you need it. And I highly recommend it. Number two, Two Face Lovers. Two Face Lovers is a story about a young woman who is madly in love with the man that she is with. She begins to have sex with him and becomes pregnant. But her lover does not want the child and convinces her to get an abortion. This happens again and again and again and her heart begins to break. So she starts sleeping with other men and from what I can tell I guess is she gets pregnant by most of them. Or that's the way it looks in the video anyway. Or that's the way I interpret it. This is one of the songs where you don't really have to understand the lyrics to know what's going on because the video will explain it in a very interesting way just by its visuals. And finally, last but not least, number one, Echo by Gumi. Yes, this is the only English Vocaloid song I have on my list, and I absolutely adore this song. The song is obviously about bipolar disorder and how she is dealing with it and how she doesn't know what to do exactly or how to cope with it. The video that's playing, you can tell it's a little bit creepy, but at the same time I think it really does fit the song, the multiple arms and the TV on the head, because in the song it does say why am I switching faster than the channels on TV, meaning why is she switching her emotions all the time. The girl in the song is completely hopeless and lost. She doesn't know what to hold on to anymore, what really keeps her going, and she doesn't quite understand what's going on with her exactly. I think this song pretty much sums up um, bipolar disorder in a very interesting and surprisingly catchy way. I listen to the song way more than I probably should, but oh well, it's a good song and I really like it. And that wraps up this list guys. Please give this video a like if you enjoyed it. Sorry if my description of the songs were a little bit short, but I kind of wanted you guys to um, go see for yourself with the information that I have given you and check out these wonderful songs for yourself. There are a lot more songs like this in the vocal community. I just wanted to point out five particular ones that I personally really enjoy. But let me know which song got you into Vocaloid. Mine was actually Akuna Musume from The Story of Evil, which is actually in this list. So yeah, let me know what yours was, and let me know if you enjoyed this list. Obviously this list is just based on opinion. Let me know your top five, or at least five of the songs that you guys really like. And also, if you are not a part of the Yandere Neko Army, hit that subscribe button right now, and join us, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye guys.